Every spring, Stone Street Farm produces a stacked roster of regally bred foals, and this year was no different. We stopped by the farm to visit a few of the latest Stone Street bred foals. Peggy Jane had a, uh, a lovely intermission filly. Looks very, very much like her full sister Gamine at this stage. Same color, uh, has the leg, et cetera, that Gamine had, and uh, kind of a bigger type into Mischief Philly. Looks like she's gonna grow that way, but uh, just a fabulous physical at this stage. Lady Aurelia, uh, she had her second foal this year uh, by into Mischief. First foal is by Curlin. A beautiful filly, uh, everything we could have hoped for. You know, beautiful balance. If I would have drawn a template of what I hoped she would have produced, uh, it would have been this. Possibly could race her, possibly could sell her. We just don't know at this stage. She would be one that, you know, I would love to race. You know, she's uh, absolutely perfect. Dreaming of Julia had a, uh, a, a another lovely, lovely filly. And uh, this is a full sister to Malafat. And uh, just physically, really, really top. I mean, uh, looks very, very much like her mother. Uh, she has the same frame, same length, you know, as her mother. Um, I would venture to say this one will look more like Dreaming of Julia than, uh, than any of the ones we've had, but uh, just top physical. Mia Mischief had a uh, curl and filly. It's her first foal. Um, you know, obviously we bought the mare out of the sale, uh, you know, kind of specifically to breed to curl. We thought she'd be a great match for curling. You know, she was ultra fast, you know, ran at two, three, four. And uh, this is her first foal by curling. Great foal for a first foal. Uh, has the parts of the fast, for, fast horse kind of on a two-turn curling frame, so we're really, really excited about her. Glenda the Good had a uh, uh, quality road filly. As you can tell, we've had a lot of fillies this year, you know, which is good for us because, you know, a lot of times we can carry on our lines and that sort of thing, but really, really nice quality road filly. Has a lot of quality road in her. Um, has the stretch, has the scope. You know, looks like she'd be early, like good magic, and looks like she'd also kind of be a nice three-year-old too like good magic. So uh, very, very nice. Authenticity had a uh, spice stand cold, full brother to charlatan. Beautiful balance, great neck, great shoulder, you know, just tremendous balance. And uh, like I would actually say, he's probably a little better at this stage than charlatan was. So uh, we're really, really excited about him. Special horse. I mean, the quality versus what we had 10 years ago, you know, we were still finding our way but now we have the mares have produced a lot of the great horses. We also have their daughters that have produced a lot of great horses. And we're starting to see the real signs of that now, I think. You know, we take a lot of pride in what we bring to auction. We try to produce an elite racehorse. Uh, we raise them the right way. We think we breed them the right way. And uh, uh, the ones that we keep ourselves, we try to put in the hands of the best trainers. And, um, you know, that's what we hope for. Thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a like or a comment and subscribe to our channel for more content from the TDN.